Hi guys, welcome back to another video. If you're new here, my name is Tori. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and to turn on your post notifications so whenever I post, you get a notification. <laughs> yeah. So as you can tell by the title of today's video, this will be a Sheen with Jordan Woods collaboration. If you don't know who Jordan Woods is, Jordan Woods is Kylie Jenner. I'm assuming you know who Kylie Jenner is. So Jordan Woods is Kylie Jenner's ex best friend. Yes. It's a lot. <laughs> Jordan Woods is Kylie Jenner's ex-best friend. There are some socialites. I think she's a socialite, newly turned businesswoman, influencer, big influencer, big model, just everything. Her IG page is Jordan Woods. You can go and check out her IG if you don't know who she is, or you can just Google her and it will give you a rundown. So Jordan Woods has done a collaboration with Sheen, and I was like, let me see what's inside Miss Jordan Woods' brain. So I went ahead and I bought some of the items from her collection because i wanted to see what's her style honestly when i was looking at the pictures they actually do look like clothes that she wears and some of them are very sparkly i hate sparkly clothes but the one sparkly one that i bought thank god it wasn't too overly sparkly and it's giving new year's vibe but we'll get into that at a later date but i just wanted to give you the introduction that you know who jordan woods is why i'm doing this haul i wanted to see the quality of what she would design in collaboration with sheen so this video is going to showcase her pieces and I'm just going to put them on, show you how they fit, tell you what I think about the material as usual, like my other hauls. And everything will be listed in the description box below. I don't have a discount code because this is not sponsored. As I said, I just went and bought these and decided that this would be something cool to show you guys. So let's just jump into the video. All the links to everything will be in the description as well as the size that I bought. So let's go. Okay guys, so the first thing that we started off with was this romper. <laughs> this one shoulder romper. And honestly, if you're watching me for the first time, I don't know. Normally, like the one shoulder anything blows rompers just is anything because I don't feel like they give my boobs enough support but I was hesitant when I was buying this but I was like it wasn't tell us the items to choose from so I was like I'm just buy that one just to see so surprisingly I actually loved this let me confirm when I'm editing and rewatching the videos but I really love this like it's hugging my body and I love the design and I noticed that most of them had this design where it had the material and then some of it is mesh it's this brown tan mesh skin like nudish mesh most of them have this material i have three items that are this material so the first one is this bodysuit i love how it hugged me the one shoulder i feel like it was supporting my bra when i'm re-watching the videos i'll confirm but when i had it on and i was looking in the mirror it looked like it was supporting my bra it's something that i could wear out i would add some tape to my boobs for extra security but the whole without the boob tape it wasn't bad the back of the jumpsuit i don't know if you own a jumpsuit if you have this problem as well where the back will like it will just have like a little space that's just really annoying like it's not fitted on your body it just has like that little space right there this one has it but it's it's minimal it's not too bad i got this in a size large the material that isn't mesh i think it's like spandex let me see <gasps> Yeah, it's not in English. <laughs> I love the contrast with the black and the brown. And I love how it fits on my body. I'll give this one an 8 out of 10 just because it had that little thing in the back. And I feel like it could have been a little bit longer. Like a little bit longer because when I pulled it up on me, I feel like it could have been a little bit longer so that's all for this one up next before i forget to talk about it is this pink dress that i am currently wearing to do the sit down so this is a pink bodycon i could not get it in a size large it was only in a medium but when i saw it i was like she jordan woods cannot have a pink bodycon and i don't get it so i had to get it and when i looked on it the large was sold out so i was like I'm going to test the medium because it's a bodycon and you know how bodycon is supposed to like hug you so normally I would get a medium in bodycons anyway girl I think I could I could even get a small <laughs> I think I could even get a small but let's not push it let's not push it more. what I don't like about this is that the straps they're like as you can see well you can see it in the sit down part so I don't have to show you <sighs> the boobies no the straps are not adjustable and that's not really no that's a no for me the straps aren't adjustable it's just a simple body come with a v-cut boob and it hugs you like the material literally hugs you but it's not the hug where it's not going to show your fupa it's the kind of hug where your fupa is going to be ver very much showing because as you can see on the video my belly is re really outside it is outside i'm bloated guys so don't even yeah i'm bloated so my belly is extra outside right now but 
yeah what i don't like about it is that my belly is extra outside it's not the material that kind of conceal you know those material that kind of conceals the fat that's not it it's going to show every single fat roll on your body they're basically already too stretched out because i have to be doing this to get the real hold that i want from it so this is probably just going to be like a supermarket dress not anywhere serious and i wasn't thinking that any of these outfits would be something that i went to the supermarket i wasn't thinking that so i'm kind of disappointed in this but it did hug me but yeah up next i think i tried on this dress it's satin and this would have to be my least favorite dress honestly because first of all i had to pop up my phone to see the instructions not instructions i had to pop up my phone to see the picture of how this actually looks on the model and even with the picture i still could not fix it this boob area right here i don't understand what's going on with it i'm looking on the picture and i'm seeing it but when I do that to mine, it just actually, it looks like that right now on camera. This is how it's actually supposed to look. But it wasn't giving that when I tried it on. And you'll see it when I try it on too. It wasn't giving this. This is exact. Oh, see, when, when I let go of it, it doesn't look like that. But it's supposed to give like a crisscross. So you have this, you have the the bralette like part right here, right? And then you have this over it. I don't, I think this was very unnecessary. And then... This should be covering half of your boob and then you're seeing your bralette for the other side of the boob. So this is actually how it's supposed to look. I'm going to pop up a picture with Jordan Woods in it. It has a string at the side so you can tie it and you can pull it up a little bit shorter. And it gets longer as it goes to the other side. Honestly, not my favorite dress. I probably will never wear this. And stay tuned to the vlogs to see what I'm going to give away because... I feel like I'm going to do a giveaway for some of these. It doesn't make any sense I keep them if I'm not going to wear them. I do not like this any at all. I don't like the satin fit. I like satin, but I don't like when satin is tight. I, th I feel like because satin, because it doesn't have any stretch, I feel like it should be like flowing. And I got this in a size large. You'll see in the description box below to confirm. But I do not like how it fit. Again, my belly was outside. That's not Jordan Woods' fault though. That's just me. <laughs> and it's just jumping the gym. But I didn't like the fit of it. You know, your belly can be big and there are some clothing that you can wear that doesn't show that your belly is that big. You know what I mean? Like, But then you have others that will make you like want to rethink life because why does my belly look like that <laughs> you get what i'm saying so this and the pink dress is one of them and i'm sure you're seeing it on the screen because they were not giving i really didn't like them no it's a strong no for me it was just too tight i didn't like the fit i didn't like the style of the dress and yeah i just didn't like it i honestly did not like it so up next we have this jumpsuit and it's a plain black jumpsuit and the back has string detail going on this one oh i didn't rate the other two but they're already gone so moving on but this one i could give this one a seven because i love the fit of it i don't think i would just wear it by itself i think i would pop a jacket over it and some boots or something i just feel like by itself it looks like something that you would see in like marshalls or something or any other affordable clothing stores it just like there's just nothing special about it it's just a jumpsuit the strings though it's not the string that you tie they are already said how they are supposed to be you can't adjust them it's you're, you're not able to tie them they're just already attached just so it has the draping and it has the strings at the back and you have a string that goes over your neck again because you can't adjust that if you don't have any support for your boobs you know how that's going to look if your boobs aren't naturally supported and if you're not wearing a tape the string that comes around your neck basically like how this string looks right now the string on the wrong part just goes around your neck and then because you're not able to adjust it that's just it that's just i don't like that about most of these the ones that have string i don't like the fact that you're not able to adjust them because we're we're big boobed and i think jordan woods has big boobs so what is this <laughs> i mean i like the design of most of them but i don't like the fact that the boob part you don't have much support on them or you you can't tie the material how you want it so you can pull up your boobs but i guess boob tape will fix that this one probably get a seven though it's just basic and yeah so moving on up next we have this dress in the same material as the romper it's a cute little fit it fit me well but again i would just wear it. these pieces need accessorizing to pull them off they're not just 
wow by themselves but i love the dress i love the dress you can see the black part is like velvet it's oh it's not the exact same as the romper because on the dress the black is velvet and then you have the brown skin like mesh but on the romper the black was like spandex and then you had the brown skin like mesh but i also like the fit of this it was short i think the fit was okay but you know this would need some accessorizing to make it really pop but I love the, I have to say that I love the, the black and the mesh. I like what it gives. I like what it gives. Like, I don't know how to explain it, but I like that little combination right there. But up next, we have this two-piece set, and I'm a two-piece set girl. I was hoping that she would have more two-piece sets, but that wasn't the case. I only saw, I think I only saw one, or the other that I saw, they were out of stock in my size, or I just didn't like how they looked. But this one could pass. This one is just like a fun outfit. It's a skirt, and then it's a top. The top, it has these these three pins for you to hook together so it's not a zipper it's not button or anything it just has these three pins right here when i was trying it on i didn't try it on with any boobs <laughs> i didn't try it on with any bra as you can see in the try on portion of the video i really wasn't lifting my arms or anything because that would just the boobs would just fly out and just run along and just have a happy day on camera so i had to be you know holding down my arms so i really don't know how i'm going to wear this top because if i wear it with a bra it's going to show and that's just tacky and no that's not that's a no-no so but i can't wear it and i'm not able to move my arms how do oh i'll probably have to get the double-sided tape and tape it down on me so it doesn't move so like i tape it on my boobs so they both stay when i'm wearing it i'll try it and let you know keep up with the vlog to find out how that goes if i do wear this when i do wear it yeah i love the material the material is thick the skirt was hugging me the skirt was hugging my fupa the skirt was kind of short so it's a thing where i have to be worrying about the length of the skirt and my boobs flying out and just enjoying themselves for other people to see that's a no-no so yeah i don't know how i'm going to wear this one but that's what it looks like up next we have another bodycon in the same material this bodycon though the black part is the spandex material as the romper so it's the spandex and the mesh oh guys i actually did try the dress on with a bra i tried the dress on with a bra but i was actually rushing so I'm almost sure I tried it on with a bra, but I was rushing, so I couldn't find the correct bra that I need to, to try it on. It's showing a little bit, but so the dress I did have on a bra when I was trying. It's the bodysuit that I didn't try and try it on with a bra, and it was holding my boobs. Like me personally, I would have to I would use tape when I'm wearing it. I always get my bodysuits in size small. Hello, small girls don't come for me. I'm not trying to finish out your sizes. You know how they say the big girls always buy the small bikinis. <laughs> And the small girl, the small girlies can't get them. But yeah, don't come for me. I'm not trying to, you know. But yeah, I need it to be a bodycon. I need it to fit on me, and I need it to suck. So all my bodysuits are always in small. I'm almost sure this one was in small, but I'll check it and let you know. But that's how it fit. However, you're seeing it on the screen. That's how it fit me, and I would need some more support, so I would I would wear it with a bra. Up next, we have this top. This is a plain, just a plain top. It actually it's actually just a little bit too stretchy for me, and it has some. This is kind of coming back in style. This little thingy this what do you call it let me see what's the name of it so it has that on the sleeves and that's just the only thing that makes it stand out apart from just some other regular crop tops it's just the fuzzy arms that makes it stand out and not going to lie guys i don't normally take a lot of risks when it comes to fashion i don't take risks when it comes to wearing clothes i will just wear normal pieces and just wear them different ways but things like these i don't do this like no <laughs> but i was like oh, let me try this little fuzzy arm and see how i can wear it but i really don't like the rest of the blows it's just it's actually already look washed out and it hasn't been washed as yet and it's just too stretchy you know that is it cheap i don't know if it's cheap material because i don't know material costing but the material just isn't giving like it's like no and it doesn't look black black already and it's not washed already so you just know that when it's washed it's going to start looking just like reddish brown and just not the vibe and just wash out but i really wanted to buy it just because of this i don't even know how this is going to hold up in a washing machine 
but we'll see we'll see this was very roomy too honestly what can i give this i will give this a let me give her a six <laughs> up next guys is the last piece and this is a dress i'm going to say this gives it new year's eve vibes because it's sparkly i don't normally go for sparkly things but you know what i was just realizing when i checked my phone for the picture for the other the other piece i put this on wrong the strings are supposed to be right here crisscross in the front i'll put up a picture so you can see and the rest of the dress is just normal but it's sparkly it has long sleeves this is definitely giving new year's eve vibe i'm almost sure i'm almost sure i'm always ready on new year's eve if i'm going anywhere because i don't even i'm not even going to cap and pretend that oh my gosh yeah i'll probably not go anywhere but if if and it's a strong if and that if is just like two percent if i do go somewhere and i don't have anything else this definitely gives new year's eve vibes it's not too sparkly but it's just that it's that color you know that that party color that classy dinner color this was very fitting i love how it hugged my body but i put it on wrong so i'm not even going to get into the fact that my arms weren't going in properly but that's because i wasn't putting it on correctly so i would give this one strangely i would give this one this one gets my highest rating this one gets a 9 out of 10 it fit me well I, I just didn't put it on right and the sparkles it wasn't too bright it's just right i don't love it but it's not too much and i thought it was going to be too much so yeah that's my sheen in collaboration with joy <laughs> That's my sheen in collaboration with Oh, come on, man. That's my sheen in collaboration with Jordan Woods Hall. Let me know which one of the pieces was your favorite and let me know what you would rate some of them. Everything will be listed in the description box below as I already mentioned. And thank you guys for watching and I will see you next week. Bye.